Police say they hit the registers and wheeled an ATM out of their store. Millersville police are now looking for their suspects. News 2's Andy Cordan takes a look in this News 2 Crime Tracker Alert. Andy? Well, the break in, it was definitely planned, but Millersville police tell me that they think stealing the entire ATM was just a lucrative crime of opportunity. It goes down around 3 a.m. at the Quickie Stop on Highway 31W. It's here that two men, covered head to toe, shielding their faces, turn surveillance cameras around to avoid detection. They pry open the front door. Using a crowbar, the men hit the cash drawers, then see a crime of opportunity, the ATM. It's not bolted down, so they get a dolly from the back and carry the entire machine out of the store ripping down ceiling tiles on their way out. Do you think it was planned that they would take the ATM? It sounds like they used the dolly from the store. That doesn't sound like it, they brought their dolly with them. No, I don't think it was planned. I think they saw an opportunity and took it. Sometimes it's tough to get into an ATM, but if they can, you're telling me there are thousands inside of it. Uh, we believe that there's approximately about $8,000 inside the ATM is where we're at right now. Take a good look at the suspect. He's shielding his face from the camera. But investigators say he's a larger, stockier man. They were pretty slick. Came in, turned around all the cameras. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so all the cameras outside, they uh, turned them and faced them up towards the sky so you couldn't really see them. Cover their faces up like this as they were walking out so you just can't see any facial features at all. So what we have here are some guys, it sounds like they knew what they were doing and maybe lucked out a little bit in terms of what they got out of here. Right. And Millersville police tell me that the suspects left in a pickup truck. Now, it was either silver or white. It could have been a Ford F-150, maybe a Nissan Titan. Back to you, Erica.